continuing our team coverage now of those walkouts. An overwhelming turnout of students also showed up at our state capitol in Denver today demanding action from lawmakers. New size Allison Zimmerman watching out for us at the capitol today. She's in studio with lawmaker reaction on this nationwide movement. Robin Elizabeth, hundreds of students from the Denver area showed up in, the, in front of the capitol today. Some lawmakers even joining along as students took action in hopes of finding a solution to stop gun violence. Through a massive crowd on the Capitol steps, guarded by several officers. Repeating chant after chant. Students ultimately hoping to send a message to lawmakers in Denver. Honestly, I'm overwhelmed um, by these young people coming out to speak their mind to us. Between clenched fists and illustrated signs, their voices heard from both sides. I knew it was coming. Did not realize it would be have the turnout it had. I'm thrilled to see uh, so many students so passionate about this issue. And the crowd even getting the attention of the governor himself. You get involved in getting people elected. You Meanwhile, people all across the state are looking to lawmakers to find solutions to an ongoing problem. I think we have to start looking at solutions. I think we need to start looking at the need to make sure our schools are protected. I'm hopeful that we will maybe finally begin to make some progress on you know, creating safety in regarding gun regulation. As school buses lined the streets outside the Capitol building, the crowd slowly dimmed away, not backing down from their fight. And gun legislation continues to make its way through the House and the Senate. Next week, a bill to ban bump stocks will be heard in a Senate committee. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado. Allison Zimmerman, News 5. Allison, thanks. Let's